Hi guys. Excuse any mess you see behind me. Um, just back in my hotel room after seeing Dan and Phil's interactive introverts. And I don't normally do videos like this, like talking about things I've been to. But I feel the need to... It was just incredible. Honestly, if you're a Dan and Phil fan, you need to see this. It's... Wow. And there's things in the show that fans have been desperate for online, like on YouTube, for so long. And they did it on the stage. And... Wow. <laughs> and my Madonna hurts from the screaming, but I'll deal with that, it's fine. Um, I told you I was exhausted. <laughs> yeah, I can still, I can still, it's coming down now, but I can still outside because this hotel is very close to the venue. I can still see people heading back from there. I can see all the Danville merch walk, walking by. <laughs> yeah, like, I've got a new hat. I don't know if I've mentioned to you guys before that I love hats, but I do, and I got a hat, a new cap, and it says introvert on it. Yes. <laughs> um, yeah, you should really go and see this. It was unbelievable. Um, even I went myself, and I, I'm not a people person at all. I don't do people, so I prefer going myself, but you guys may think differently. So I would just say from the way I see it, you should not let having no one to go with you stop you going to these things, because if you want to see something that's going to let you enjoy yourself, you should just go. And I don't have people to go to things with me. So I just go myself and I have a blast and I tend to find people at things accidentally. It just happens. Um, yeah, my arm hurts. I'm not using a tripod right now, I'm using my arm. I'm using my hand. And it's, I don't like this. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, how do I tell you about it without telling you about it? Uh, each show, like they've said, will definitely be different. So, there isn't really much you can spoil, but the aspects of it, I suppose you can. Um, it is very much personalised to that audience. Um, so, like, the show here will be very different to the show they did in London, for example. And they do personalise it a little bit, they brought up Scottish things, which of course the audience loved. Talking about Scottish things to a Glaswegian audience, you're doing well. <laughs> yeah. So if you're a Danville fan, you should definitely go and see it. I am so glad I went. I don't see them doing another tour. To do with that one. Sorry, cause I'm not looking at this. I keep looking away. So my arm keeps going down. Uh, yeah. So I think I did the Dan and Phil fandom origin video. I'm not entirely sure, but I think I did. I think I've done that one. I've at least thought about it. <laughs> So, yeah, if you haven't watched any Dan and Phil or you don't even know who Dan and Phil are, look them up, get into them, they are incredible guys, um, utterly hilarious, and you'll be glad you got into them, yeah. Bye, guys.